Yo, what is up everybody? Exus here and welcome back to Apocalypse Party. Today we are going to try the football player again because yesterday we did a live stream and we had a fantastic run and then it crashed. <laughs> it was horrible and I want to recreate it as best I can. I don't know how well we're going to be able to just because how good the run actually was, but we're going to try to unlock two things. We're going to try to unlock the arcane staff, clear the stage without picking up any weapons. So we're not going to change weapons ever, but we're also going to try to unlock the wheelchair, clear the stage without initiating any attacks. So we're not even going to fire the weapon. So we're going to get firearm talents. And unfortunately, we just have to deal with it. And hopefully we get lucky like yesterday and we're able to get some really, really good talents. Uh, we're going into chapter three, the nightmare, and let's see how this ends up going. How is everyone doing today? I hope everyone is doing well. I am doing fantastic. Excited to be trying this. Thank you to everyone who came out to the live stream and hung out. It was a blast. I will be announcing another one um, and hopefully you can make it. We had a really good time. And yeah, we had two crashes, unfortunately, which is only three in total that I've ever had playing this game, knock on wood. But let's see what we get. Enemy kills caused by projectiles. Nope. Dealing damage has a slight chance of instantly killing the enemy and restoring one HP and effective against bosses and elites. I'm just going to grab this. It's a very no, I'm, I'm not even going to grab that. That's a that's a stupid low chance. <laughs> Attack speed does not have any effect for us. Uh, we can go with crit rate. That's fine. We're not going to keep rerolling again. We're going to see a lot of firearm talents. Hopefully we can get some talents for colliding with enemies because then the game is more likely to give you other things like that. This game again is really good with tags, but yeah, I don't even want to open boxes because I don't want to be tempted. I'm barely even touching the mouse. Because I don't want to accidentally shoot the weapon. But we were so close. I think we were level, what was it, 24 when the game crashed? Maybe 23. I don't remember. We were close to being almost done, and it was crazy. The live stream is on the channel if you want to go back and watch it and just kind of see it. We had some really fun runs. Uh, but the second run was us trying to unlock the 5,000 kills in one run, and that one crashed pretty early in the run. We only had like 1600 kills or something like that, but it was still unfortunate. Still very unfortunate. Movement speed is good, but no, we're probably going to take this one. Equipment obtained windmill turbo moving generates power to make your next attack deal bonus lightning damage. Max power 200% of your regular weapon damage. Now, I don't know if it affects this. But we're going to try it. We're going to try it. Let's see. Okay, it does 12. I don't. Unless it's consistently doing it. I don't know. But that's okay, because now we have a giant windmill on our back, and that's kind of cool. And the thing about this run is we're kind of close to where I like to be. And I overstated that in the live stream. Small corridors are great because you don't run into stuff. Well, you try not to anyways. But knowing me, we're definitely going to run into stuff. And it just lines up the enemies so good. Like we can just kind of run into them. I'm going to grab this, though. Just because I think it'll make. Yeah, it makes us do a lot more damage. Get rid of that elite quickly. Um... Fulminous Phantom, upon taking damage, creates a Fulminous Phantom that taunts when destroyed. Eh, we're going to see some lightning stuff now, which is kind of sad, but within a certain range for each electrified enemy, movement speed increases by 5%. Now, what did that do again? Deals bonus lightning damage. I don't think we're doing lightning damage. I don't think this worked. I hate rerolling this much. 
kind of unfortunate. Um, but yeah, I need a. All right, let's see. We're going to take this gain one to three talents and let's see what happens. We're starting to draw nice shot. You can draw two. One is Dragon Knight. The other is Scout. Dragon Knight movement speed and crit damage and movement speed and firearm. So we got a lot of movement speed. That's good. That's good. Dragon Knight's really good. We've already wasted a lot of reroll. I, I won't say wasted. We and we will get some more. You know when we kill the the altar, trying to get rid of the stone skin before that. There probably will be one more elite too. All right, level five. Give me something good. Uh, demonic gunner is not where we want to be. Oh, here we go. Yeah, this is what we want. Armor and armor cap both increased by 20. Deals weapon damage equal to 15% of the armor cap against enemies upon against enemies upon collision. So it gives us the collision tag ish. We almost got hit by that. We go, we, we slowed down because we lost our bonus. All right, thorns. Thorns is annoying. Because we for sure lose armor against thorns. But we'll get him and we'll heal up. But we have no other way to do damage at this very moment. We want a good sacred ability to take care of thorns. Yeah, we didn't lose too much. We didn't lose too much. That wasn't terrible. Wasn't great. But it wasn't terrible. All right, level six. Uh, leaves a frozen frost zone. No. Projectile. Ugh. We don't reload. Okay. This is. I don't think we're doing any. We're not having luck. Let me tell you. Movement speed, lightning damage. Sure. Again, I don't think we're actually doing any lightning, lightning damage. Doesn't look like it. But we want movement speed. We always take movement speed. There's that lame stealth. Oh, give me one second. All right, we are back. And of course, I was not holding the button. <laughs> That's all right, let's go. Let's one, get rid of stealth. He's annoying. Got him. Nice. Um, let's just we'll pop it. We'll pop it. Who is it? Headless. Okay. We gotta go kill his little minion, which is good. Just gotta watch out. Just gotta watch out. That's all we gotta do. Movement speed is fine. Not good. Uh, attack speed and movement speed. I'll probably just take this. We might get projectiles, right? You never know. This is 10%. We're just going to take movement speed. We're going to be fast. We're definitely not getting as lucky as the video, but hopefully. Oh, he got me. That little side swing got me good. Don't, don't don't do it. Don't do it. Oh, he got me. Oh, he tried. <laughs> this is like such a different fun run. We were having a blast with it yesterday. Um, do auto attack. Should I just get the Vi Should I just get the Vikings? Nope. Each bonus one percent move speed increases attack speed. That's lame. <laughs> you know, I don't want to waste. I do. I don't really want summons. Um, when suffering from armor loss, deals range lightning damage to nearby enemies. We're going to take that just because we do have some lightning damage. Sure. 
Now we actually got to get some armor because, you know, if I get hit now, I take health loss. He was not invincible for very long, so that is good. And as you can see, we do decent damage. We just got to watch out for the attacks. Oh, and I also lowered the graphics and it made it look like daytime, which I'm super happy for because I couldn't stand playing when it looked all night and dark. So that's why it looks light when it usually looks dark on chapter three. So if you also like the light, uh, just lower your graphics to low. <laughs> He's trying, but we are speedy. If we play well, we should almost be able to avoid any of the melee attacks from any bosses, like any other telegraphs. Got to get his little pal. He tried. He tried to save him. Um. Ooh, when not moving in a straight line, 35%. A fierce blizzard swirls around you dealing frost damage. I, I didn't take this yesterday, and I think I was wrong not taking it. Because it swirls around me too. So we're going to take Elsa and just see how it goes. See if it's extra. It is extra frost damage. That's good. I should have took that yesterday. Ow. Got him. Get some more rerolls. That's good. Did we get one of our good sacred abilities? I don't think we did. Uh, let's grab that one. All right, we're level nine. Somehow we got hit by that. I don't know. Sure, sure, sure. Sometimes you run too fast and you run right by it. Please be an actual reroll. The next weapon. See, yeah, we don't care about weapons. Heal guy, like it. Just knock him out. You know, if you don't move in a straight line, you do more damage. No, I didn't pick that one. I took Elsa. That's a good one, too. Let me tell you. We had that one yesterday. That was really good. We need a serpentine. Serpentine all over the place. It's just very nice. <laughs> uh, Molnir, we're going to probably take Molnir purely because we have lightning damage. Yeah, we're going to take Mjolnir. We're going to take it. Ah, I got stuck. See, normally in this, I'd like want a good like melee weapon, probably. But we're not swinging. We're not shooting. We're not changing our weapons. So we're basically hands off keyboard or excuse me, hands off mouse, which chat yesterday wanted me to unplug my mouse. Y'all are crazy. All right, let me get back to the future. OK, Um. wait, hold on. Scoring a critical hit increases my movement speed, but there's always a past version of you that mimics your movement Three seconds ago, it deals high weapon damage when it collides with an enemy, which is also considered a collision. Press G to quickly rewind and to move back to its position to get, briefly gain invincible. This can be used once every... We're just going to take this one. We never take it. We're going to take it. Look at him go. It's extra damage. He runs in circles with me. It's actually pretty sweet. I like that. We're about to... You take three armor damage from something rude. Oh, fire guy. Didn't even see him. We're just gonna take a couple damage here. I need, I need to. All right, listen, it's not taking any damage. I pop my my thing. Each point of armor cap increases firearm. Don't care. Uh, equipment, which is that. So it'll increase all those and it's frost damage. Um, this isn't bad either. It's actually really not bad. I don't know if that'll count, though. We're gonna take Frost Forager.
And I need this guy to go away. He's not taking any damage. Oh, good. They also popped. He's just standing in fire, which is nice. There we go. Okay, good. Good. Now we can pop this. Just, uh, okay. Ow. Just instantly hit us. That's cool. Listen here. Rude. Now she's just jumping in the air. Oh. Gotta watch out for the green things. I don't know about that one. I don't know about that one. We just gotta survive this. <laughs> I don't want to lose that much HP. That seems r really rough. Frost and range damage. I'm gonna reroll here. See if we get anything better. Uh, yeah, we're gonna take this one just in case we die. When taking lethal damage, armor instantly restores to 50%. Triggers only once each life. Having that little mini safety net is... It's good. It's a good thing. She's just standing by her tornado, and that's annoying. That's annoying. And she's messing with my movement speed. Trying to put my like, Molnir out here so when it does spawn, it goes that way. I got hit. I saw that one coming too. That was bad. Bad play. Good job, Elsa. Okay. Okay, just run away from her. Don't let her hit ya. Drop Elsa on her face. That was nice. Tornadoes stay a lot longer than they used to. A lot longer. All right, we almost got her. We ran right into that tornado. Cool. And she's gone. Nice. All right, let's see. Uh, each kill... And a killing spree increases crit rate. That's not bad. But frost damage. Ah. Uh, it's only 15%. I need something that does better. When not attacking, restore 3 HP after a certain distance traveled. This is not bad. And we're going to take it because, as you can see, we're not full health. Uh, this just helps. And, you know, if we get in trouble, it just it kind of helps. And we're moving so fast that it's a good thing. What do we get? Master of Shadow, Tesla Cage. Um, I don't. I'm just take Master of Shadow. Hey, look at that. It is healing. That's not very fat, like far either. Like we don't have to run very far to get the three health. That was worth. That was definitely worth, especially if we can't get like more armor. Look at that. Just destroy the rampage. Get him. Oh, rude. <laughs> we do need a way to restore armor too. Uh, let's go teleport. See where it takes us. Took us to a nice armor place, which is fantastic. Next upgrade must be epic. Nice. We do like that. I did not get the armor while I was in there. Okay. Reroll? Nope. Okay. I really wanted those to be rerolls. We're not doing nearly as much damage as we were yesterday. We were doing like 500 damage. 
uh we don't i don't want lightning oh this is actually not bad though but increase attack speed i want movement speed i want movement speed things this is so good <laughs> This is also pretty good if we're going that, but this is so good. We don't attack. Uh, so just give me 40% movement speed. Like what? We're, we're so quick. We're making our way over to the, the summon more stuff. Or, you know, we're just going to get stuck. That's cool, too. Don't mind us. There we go. We're hitting for 231. Okay. I wanted this right here. So we can summon more enemies. We're level 16. Uh, equipment damage. Molnir. That's a curse and turbo when the turbo doesn't work. I don't think with this build. So uh, each piece of equipment increases armor cap by five points. Uh, we're going to take that. Give me some more armor. Yes, it's like 15. Yep, yep. A lot of enemies, a lot of enemies. Kill that guy so he's not invincible. Nice. We like just running around. It's it's a fun, fun, fun build. I know we've kind of done this before, but not to this extent. That hurt. I think that was a skull. But when you can line them up though like this, feel, it feels nice. Yeah, we're not doing nearly as much damage as yesterday. Hopefully we can get a couple more skills that can boost it because that was gross. Um, yeah, we don't care about that. Uh, movement speed plus five when suffering armor loss. Movement speed increases by 50% for five seconds. Sure. I mean, we're bound to lose a little bit of armor here and there. I think I just saw a thorns guy. Oh, no, he healed. That's rude. Oh, there we go. See, movement speed. Movement speed. Ooh, look at all these enemies. Hello, hello, hello. Oh, that was that was delicious. <laughs> Increases attack speed. Don't care. Uh, each fires a barrage. Dealing weapon damage. Each piece of equipment owned increases weapon damage. I don't think our move is considered weapon. Or does it? It does and deals weapon damage. We have five equipments. I think we just take Gilgamesh. Oops, slow down. I think Gilgamesh is good. A little bit of lightning, a little bit of lightning. Lighting them up. Funny enough, this was like the area I crashed in yesterday, I think. <laughs> I'm gonna take Canada Goose. Frost damage, armor cap, yes. I'm gonna dip. Let's dip. Into the cave system, right? I'm trying to grab it. Don't judge. Next up next upgrade must be epic or higher. That's not a bad one. Please grab that. Thank you. Lost our movement speed, of course. That's alright. We're still so fast though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just a couple more levels. 
Just a couple. <laughs> I'm gonna head over to the caves. I'm telling you, the caves were juicy yesterday with mobs. This isn't the same cave though, sadly. But yeah, there was also a run from the live stream that I think I'm going to make into a video. I just have to edit it a little bit. Um, but I think it was such a fun, busted, broken run that way we actually didn't, you know, die on. <laughs> well, not die, but crash because we crashed a lot. Two times is a lot. And but yeah, we are definitely we're probably going to make a video out of that one. It's just fun. Okay, a drone, a radiant shield, which gives us more armor cap. Inflicts full stack of ignite ignition on enemies within a certain range. And that's OK. I don't really want the fire tag. I'm going to reroll. We are going to take up a tier. More movement speed, and it's a little bit of equipment damage. We are taking some armor damage from the fire boy. Okay, we have five more levels. Having some fun, running around. I wish enemies would spawn a little bit faster. That would help a little bit. A thorns boy. I don't like thorns, as you know. Tries to hurt us. Run to the frozen. Ah, oh, we hit him. Nice. I like that we have that cool sword on our back too. I forgot what skill that was, but saw the XP had to, had to go back for the XP. If I see the XP, I promise I go back for it. Uh, let's see, movement speed. I don't really understand continuous effects. I mean, I do. I think that's like Elsa, so I might do more damage with that. All right, let's see. Nope, it doesn't say it's continuous, though. Radiant shield. This one's okay. Each point of armor cap increases equipment damage by 1%. It's not that much. All right, that's, that's what, 75? And again, equipment. We have a lot of equipment. We're just going to take mobile suit. We have no rerolls. Can't worry about it. Now we're just kind of taking what whatever the game gives us is what we are stuck with. And we're hoping that the game is gentle to us. What was that? Demon's blood? Demon's blood? Saw this big old line of enemies that was just w wanting to to get run over, so I had to. I had to come back. I love how bright it is. Changing the graphics was great. I don't know why it doesn't feel like the XP is as abundant when I do this run, but it is only 19 minutes. So I'm not sure. Or almost 20. See, I like this long hallway. It's just a nice straight run. No turns. Who likes to turn? <laughs> Let's 
Yeah, the damage is just not the same. It's still good, but it's not the same. It will never, it'll never be the same. It's okay. Uh, every four seconds, shoot an electric ricochet at the closest enemy. Might as well. We do have lightning damage ish. So that's fun. Reroll. <sighs> Don't care about the weapon being epic. What, what, what a weapon are you going to give us? Staff of Flames. I see that little white shadow running around and it freaks me out every once in a while because I'm like, what is that? And I forget it's our shadow that's running. And there's a lot better talents we could have gotten with this. Trust me, I know. Um, just didn't happen this time. But we're still doing really good. I just don't know how good we're going to do against... Uh, with uh, Satan because of his... All of his telegraphs. We just got to dodge. We gotta be good. We're about to hit level 23. Sweet. Give me something good, please. Each 1% bonus movement speed. Ah, oh, it's attack speed. For each curse you obtained. These are all pretty lame. Uh, well, we've attained like one curse, right? Yep. So we're going to take this. Just because one little umber bolt. One little sad umber bolt around us. And that's the bad thing. We had some really good rerolls uh, yesterday. Did not get lucky today. But I would say we're still mowing them down. Where is everything? Where is where is everybody? Am I just running too far away from enemies? Is that what's going on? Because I feel like there's not enough enemies on the map. This feels that way. I feel like I probably am just running away. Yeah, see, look at look how many enemies there are back at the castle. Where they've had time to spawn. <laughs> I don't want to see if the Master of Shadows slows me down. Does not. Do they count, though? I don't know if they count. It's hard to tell. These aren't the... This wasn't the sacred ability I wanted. Uh, scoring a critical hit with lightning damage inflicts bonus lightning damage. Restore 10 points of armor when casting. I'm just going to go to the toilet. Does frost damage. And well, yeah, it's a toilet. <laughs> I'm going to try to drop this Elsa right on top of. Nope. And I knocked him away. Firewalk's a bit of a nuisance. Just a bit. Get him. Oh, got him. Nice. Okay. We're almost there. Almost there. Big bag of experience. Give it to me. Yes. We are the speed. Gotta go fast. All right, here we go. About to be 25. So get in there and summon. Okay. We're just going to take this one because that's all. Or we can. Because I don't do like lightning damage. It's only from some like Molnir. Um, Molnir, Lion's Heart. 
uh that one just lightning damage and the turbo does nothing uh yeah on this one nuclear i'm gonna take this one so it just gives me more sacred ability right horseman no this is like the worst one for us I don't like this guy. Please don't summon your child. That's all I ask. Ow. I don't have to deal with two of them. It's all, it's so good. Please no. Oh, thank goodness. Jeez, okay. All right, did we get... Ah, Frost Nova. That's exactly what we wanted. Let's charge up our... Sacred Ability, and we're just gonna go. There ain't a whole lot we need to do. Wish us luck. We just gotta watch out for his swings. That's what we gotta watch out for. Oh, he went invincible. I was not expecting him to go invincible. That's rude. That's very unfortunate. That would have done a lot of damage to him. That hit us? Okay. It's fine. We run away because he's gonna do his little gonna try to do his little swing. Yep. Nice land in it. I like it. Okay. Hit him with the third swing. Hit him a little. Ah, he did it again. Alright, just run around. Get your sacred ability up. Drop it on him. <laughs> Dropping a sacred ability. Hit him with it. We're doing okay. It's not amazing damage. Like, don't get me wrong. I know it's not amazing damage. But it's okay damage. It's into a swing. Got him. Okay. Okay, okay. Okay. One more to worry about. This one's a little bit, like, different. Just get sacred ability. He's gonna do his swings. He loves doing his backup swings. Oh, oh, I ran to that. That was my bad. Okay, just run away. Trying to get him to go invincible before we use our sacred ability. Or go to the center, I should say. That's not it. That's not the one we were talking about. When do you go to the center? There he goes. There he goes. Ow. Come on. Give it to him. Give it to him a little bit. That was nice. <laughs> that was really nice. What a fun run. Wasn't as overpowered as yesterday, but that's okay. We did it. Victory, and I think we unlocked some things. Let's see. Yes, we did it. We unlocked both of the other talents for him, and we unlocked the Arcane Staff and the Wheelchair. Sweet. So the Arcane Staff is a staff. The Wheelchair, the Melee, I'm assuming we drive around in the wheelchair. Maybe. That's what I'm assuming. I love it. 
If you enjoyed this video and you want to see more, let me know down below. Let me know what kind of runs you want to see. And we'll try to get them done. There will be another live stream. I will announce it on the community tab uh, for next week sometime. Not exactly sure when, but it will be there. And I hope to see you there. Um, I fixed a link down in the Discord if you wanted to join the Discord channel. Didn't realize that it had expired, even though it shouldn't have. But if you want to join the Discord, come say hello. Please feel free to do so. If you enjoyed this video, please consider giving a like and subscribe. It helps out the channel greatly. Thank you all so much for all your support. It really means the world to me. And I hope you all have a wonderful, wonderful day. Take care, and we'll see you next time. See ya.